Hey, Rock and Roll Olivia here, Rock and Rag Magazine, and it's my pleasure to introduce to you Scooney G again. I mean, I just worked with you, but like, Hi. we've been doing a lot of this lately, huh? Yeah, it's been a lot of fun. Yep. It's very cool. Scooney G came to Palm Springs to honor Alvin Taylor, right? Oops. Gotta, uh, gotta honor the man, Alvin Taylor. What a great guy he is. You know, I just met him, you know, we were up at the Willie Bass Memorial, that's where I met you as well, uh, in December, and we played with Slash. Yeah. It was fun, there was only maybe 100 people there. Yeah, private event, but, and meeting Alvin, like, at the perfect time, because the drummer that was supposed to play with us wasn't there. I and I was like, I was emceeing the thing, and I was like, almost panicked, and then somebody goes, Alvin Taylor just walked in. I was like, oh, he didn't even have time to take his coat off. Like, he literally came up on stage and just played. It was that quick. Yep. It was so cool. I'm like, this is a magic moment right here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Alvin and Willie go way back. They're really old friends. I'm a friend of Willie's, but, I mean, I'm not that old. Well, maybe I am. But <laughs> Willie used to live right down the street from me, so it's just funny. But, like, Alvin has been close with me, and he's played in my fiance's band, fiance that just recently passed away for years, so. Wow, and we are just so blessed to know these fantastic, not only musicians, but just fantastic people like you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I agree. <laughs> and you. Thank you so much. And I'm just honored to be able to, I mean, they got a rock and roller down here. You hear the music. It's like R&B and kind of like soul. But I just do rock and roll. So I'm going to do my thing, you know, and hopefully they'll like it. It's, it's rock and roll, but it's got a little soul in it, too, I guess. Alvin's a rock and roller, you know. Yeah. He's a rocker. He's worked with Elton John, George Harrison, Eric Burden, the Animals. He actually worked with Fleetwood Mac. He was on the first ever Saturday Night Live. All those shows, Don Kirshner's rock concert, American Bandstand, Soul Train. He's done it all. Wow, that is amazing. I, I can't even say, like, how honored I am to just be here. So thank you guys so much. Thank you, Olivia. Thank you, Alvin. Wow. Well, we can't wait to see you. And you run Scooney G's. Kids Rock School? Yeah, Kids Rock Studio, www.kidsrockstudio.org. And then I'm also hosting Thursday nights at the Rainbow Bar and Grill. That's our home. The last Thursday of every month, Rainbow Bar and Grill, Scooney G and Friends. I'll be there this Thursday, by the way. I'm also going to the Whiskey to watch my friend's band, too, Dan Crenshaw. So he's playing with Jakey e. Lee. I mean, he's opening for them. and But he plays with a lot of celebrities, but he's got his own band right now called Garden of Eden. So I'm doing a double, triple thing. I'm going to see you guys, you, and them. <laughs> wow, so you're a Scooney G and Friends virgin. Uh, in a way, well, well as no. far as the rainbow goes, as yes. As the rainbow, yeah. But you actually saw what we do at the Willie Bass thing. So that's basically what we do. It's just me and all of my good friends joining us in Hollywood for a really fun night. You played my uh, NAM show jam. That's too. right. We did the NAM show jam. That was fun. We had the kids perform. And we just, you know, it's a blessing to be on this planet and play music. So wherever I can go and play music, if it's on the sidewalk with my acoustic guitar, I'm over there doing that. Or a place as beautiful as this. Yeah. That's where we're honored to have you here. This is a great night, isn't it? Absolutely. Wonderful. Yeah. It's rock and roll, okay? Woohoo!